Why is it important to adhere to all recommended safety precautions when it comes to electric vehicles? I'm Jason Stahl, and we're going to find out next in the AirPro Diagnostics Collision Garage. When it comes to battery electric vehicle and hybrid electric vehicle repair safety, collision repairs cannot be overprepared. After all, EV safety is truly a matter of life and death. If you give electricity the opportunity to flow through your body, it will. There is absolutely zero room for error. Things to keep in mind before an EV is authorized for repair at your shop include designated room for repair. EV safety precautions are not solely limited to a shop's interior. They must extend to your shop's parking lot with a special section allocated for BEV and HEV vehicles. Live until verified. Operate under the assumption that any EV brought to your shop has a live charge until you've used proper diagnostic tools to verify. Tagging. Use of a color-coded labeling system to clearly tag each EV serves to alert all staff members to the status of a vehicle before the battery has been officially disengaged. Interior space. Once an EV rolls inside, it's important to commit a designated space within your shop where BEV and HEV vehicles are being repaired and access can be limited to those authorized to work in the space. Disconnect. Once inside the shop in the designated space, it's critical to engage the vehicle's parking brake to prohibit any tire rotation that could create a charge. Then it can be put on the lift for further inspection and the disconnecting procedure of the high voltage system. Review the OEM's emergency response guide. Of course, following an OEM's repair procedures is critical to performing a complete, safe, and quality repair. Once you've verified that a battery is disconnected and there's no charge, be mindful of battery concussions. Much like a brain concussion, some batteries do not look damaged upon visual inspection. Never assume the battery is okay. Potential damage could be lurking underneath as chemical reactions in batteries take time to develop. The biggest risk is for a battery to be out of balance, meaning several battery cells are holding different voltage levels. Imbalanced cell values create internal resistance between the cells, resulting in increased internal temperatures, which could lead to a thermal event. Wearing proper PPE cannot be overstated. Wearing PPE adds another level of protection in the event of an unseen or unknown danger or fault, including accidentally touching something that is energized. In our next video, we're going to discuss the best and first EV tool. I'm Jason Stahl from the AirPro Diagnostics Collision Garage. Thanks for watching.